And now, ladies and gentlemen in attendance and boxing fans joining us around the world, live from Minneapolis, Minnesota, it's time for the BBC main event of the evening. That is out of the ordinary. They'll correct it, look at it, and make sure that you're not overweight. And oh, Alvarez, oh, Alvarez, he's out on his feet. No, he's not. No, he is out on his feet. The rope saved him from going down. Yes. And believe me, he's going to get knocked out right here uh, because we still got a minute 19, and Laura's just getting warmed up. Hey, Laura. Alvarez needs to move his head. He's got his head in one spot. Oh, what a big left by Laura. Yeah. Laura, oh, I think it's I, I think this fight's done. It's all over. Yeah. Who couldn't see that coming? Right as the referee Mark Nelson stopped the fight, Alvarez corner threw in the towel as well. And here you can see the first good knockdown. And let me tell you, Laura threw some great punches there, great left hands, and they were accurate. They were on the chin. And he threw right. two in a row, and he could see Alvarez was wavering for those two left hands, and he just followed it right through. He put his hands down. He knew it was over. All right, and here we go. Here's the follow-up to what we just saw right there. There's a little right uppercut left hand. That didn't do a lot of damage. There's a little chop left hand on the inside. Alvarez is holding. But here's where he's going to go to work. There's the left uppercut. There's the left hand over the top. And there's a big one right there, right on the chin. Two in a row. And here comes another one, three, four, big left hands with a hook in between. There's five and a right uppercut. And here we go. You, you know, it's just a repeat of what we just saw. There's two double right hands right there. And um, he just gets measured with the jab, a little short left hand, another uh, left hand. And the ref jumps in. But at the same time the ref was jumping in, uh, Alvarez's brother threw in the towel. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time of two minutes, three seconds in round number two. A referee in charge, Mark Nelson, had seen enough and calls a halt for the contest. He is the winner by way of knockout. And once again, the WBA super welterweight champion of the world, Eddie Slundy, the American dream, Lotta. A two-time champ at 36 years old. How good does it feel to have that guy back on your shoulder? Dos veces campeón, Irlanda y Lara, los 36 años. Qué bien se siente tener el título otra vez. Primero que todo, quiero darle las gracias a Tim Álvarez por aceptar esta pelea que se se nos dio a nosotros. Hicimos buen trabajo y cada cual se preparó para ganar. Bueno, fui mejor que él y aquí tengo el título de nuevo. First of all, I want to thank Team Alvarez. Thank you for giving me the work that I needed today. He came out to, to fight and try to beat me, so I thank him for that. But, you know, I thank my team, and especially having this title uh, here on my shoulders feels great. You know, with all of the, the weight saga, did this go exactly like you thought it would? Con todo lo que estaba pasando sobre el peso, que él vino sobre peso, así fue que tuviste la pelea, como pasó hoy. No, con todo lo que estaba pasando sobre el peso, me sentí como quiera que sea, me sentí el peso. Son cuatro libras de diferencia, pero bueno, sube, supe trabajar duro sobre ese de, sobre ese defecto y aquí tuve la victoria. Yeah, I can't kid myself. I did feel those four pounds that were extra there. That, uh, and from his part, you know, uh, he should have come at weight basically. And uh, I'm happy of having the title, but uh, yeah, I felt the four pounds definitely. Thank you for watching. Well, if you enjoyed that clip, make sure you click uh, somewhere around here and subscribe from Fight Highlights to exclusive interviews. We have got everything you need as a boxing fan right here on PBC on Fox.